Hello, and welcome to What's New in Genially, a quick spin through our latest features and updates in under two minutes. Let's take a look. Looking for new ways to increase engagement? Try adding quiz type questions to your content while creating useful data. True or false, multiple choice, select the picture, choose questions to engage your audience and put them to the test. With Genially Master, you can view the number of correct responses and see how much time people spent on each question. A dream come true. We've released a couple of updates to allow more people to access Genially content. You can now label text with HTML headings via the accessibility icon. This allows screen readers to detect the structure and hierarchy of text. On top of that, you can add alt text to graphs and charts, providing users of assistive technologies with a text equivalent of the data shown in the diagram. This graph shows that users spend a lot of time on social media. Oh, and don't forget it's also possible to navigate all Genially content using keyboard commands. Is learning new things what gets you up in the morning? In the Genially Academy, we've got some new content design courses. Learn how to create interactive content for social media or how to use Genially, from beginners to advanced level. If you work in learning and development, check out this learning path designed especially for training professionals. Looking for resources in other languages? Loads of our courses are now available in Portuguese, Italian, and German. As you know, we're constantly releasing new templates. In the gallery, you'll find new designs for videos, diagrams, training manuals, infographics, teaching resources for your classes, and tons more. That's it for this update. Have fun with these new features and subscribe to our channel for all the latest Genially updates.